afternoon guys it has been a hectic morning I'm running about four different errands but we got it all done and I got 200 feet of bubble wrap so let's just say I don't think I'm gonna need any more bubble wrap um, for the end of packing so <clears throat> I got that got more tape got some food and a couple other things we had to do and let me just say I am tired <laughs> Um, uh, well, I can't really show you because you're propped up on it. Here, I got myself some coffee at Walmart because I am just, um, I woke up at 8, took my med. I cannot express enough how grateful I am that in a couple hours, two hours, um, I am on my last dose of the antibiotic because I don't have to stay up late, don't have to get up early, and it's just like, yes, it makes me so 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 happy um and that should keep me covered until i can get the tooth extracted um on the 7th so it's like yes yes to be done um i mean as far as amoxicillin goes it's really nice because i basically don't have any side effects from it at all um but it'll be really really nice to be done with it um so <clears throat> I haven't really eaten anything today yet because uh, we've been so busy so I'm just having a little snack of rice pudding for now and then because I feel kind of lightheaded so I'm eating that quickly and then I'm going to get all the dogs fed and taken out and then uh, have some lunch for real and just kind of rest. I don't think I'm going to get any packing done today. I think I'll start that up again tomorrow just because this morning was so hectic. Um, we left at 9 o'clock this morning and we didn't get back till almost 2. Um, so. Just because this morning was so hectic, I think I'm not going to uh, do so any packing today. Um, just rest until I head to the barn in about three and a half hours. Um, so that's okay though, because I got I got the supplies now, so I'm not like stuck waiting for them. Um, but <clears throat> anyway, yeah. Well, I did get myself. I guess I can open this on camera. I I've only had been able to find these in Florida. And I finally found one here, um, so I got a Kinder Egg. I didn't mean to get a frozen one. I thought it was just a regular one, but we'll see what's in it. I really hope it's not Kristoff again, because I have two of those. Oh, what you want to bet it's going to be Kristoff? Oh, it's not. Ooh, it's not something I have. It's Disembodied Elsa. Come on. I'm not going to put it together on camera, but it's really weird. It, that's what it is. Cool. I didn't have that one yet. So, I mean, that's a little creepy, but she'll be pretty when she's put together. Um, so I'm going to eat this and get the dogs taken care of and uh, just chill out for the afternoon. Last one! <laughs> Which means no more watching the clock. No more late nights or early mornings. It's the last one. It's about celebrating the little things, people. And today I am celebrating the last antibiotic dose. I'm out here doing some work with Blondie and she is doing amazing. Um, I've been I've been having her turn toward her uh, the side she can see. Um, but today I kind of try to see what she would do if I had her turn toward her blind side. And uh, she did pretty good. She got a little freaked out the first time. Um, but the second time she did really good. So basically what I do with her right now is I'm just putting the rope around her, I, I, I wish I had like a GoPro to my forehead or something I could film it, but just putting the rope around her neck and then asking her to turn, because um, she still gets a little confused when I ask her to go forward, so I just ask her to turn, and then I take it off, give her a minute or two, try again, and do that like five or ten times and um, call it a day, and, you know, a little bit every day is adding up, she's doing really well. Now, unfortunately, if she's going to keep walking back there, <laughs> I won't be able to get to her. Sometimes I think she does it on purpose, but once well, she clears these logs, we'll do it again, and uh, yeah, she's doing really well. Okay, so I'm heading down to go see Duncan and Ollie, but the main key of working with her right now is patience, and it's really hard because, like, we're, do we're working maybe five minutes a night. That's it. And it's like she's doing so good I want to keep going but at the same time I don't want to push it she's doing so good because of what I've been doing um, and not pushing it and just keeping it to a little bit every night I don't 
a dog. Um, so it's like, I know my success is because of the way I've been training her, but at the same time, she's doing so good, it's like I want to, you know, push it. And obviously, I feel a little bit of a kind of a pressure deadline just for myself. Hi, Denali. Because, um, you know, we're leaving on the 19th, so I have to remind myself, but, um, you know, practice makes perfect and slow and steady wins the race. So, five minutes every night uh, will add up to big results. Even tonight, she did better because she hadn't. Uh, she hadn't turned on her blind side before, so, and then when I asked her to turn on her sided side, she, uh, I mean, she picked her head right up and, um, and turned, and it used to be she'd try to bite me if I did that, so, um, we made progress. You're a silly boy, what are you doing? It's just, uh, just a matter of patience. These, these horses are masters of teaching me patience. Hey guys, so I just got home from the barn. I actually got home pretty early. Um, cause he fed them early. It's only like seven and I've already taken the dogs out. Um, so works for me. Although this is really weird and slightly annoying. I've been like dragging my feet tired all day. I had to like force myself out of bed this morning and kind of like dragged my way through the day. And now that it's evening time, I'm just like, Doo -doo 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 -doo. like I am like full of energy. Explain that one to me. But um, I'm going to take a bath, um, and, um, my mom is making some homemade, well, not homemade spaghetti, spaghetti noodles, but homemade spaghetti sauce, um, for dinner, and I'm looking forward to that, so I'm going to take a bath while that's cooking, and, um, I'm debating on whether I'm going to throw in a load of laundry tonight or tomorrow. I think I'm going to try and throw it in tonight. Um, so... With that said, and my random ramblings, thank you guys so much for coming along on my day today, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night!